taken to the sky above Petrie to commemorate the lives of two pilots killed in training. The mid-air collision happened 56 years ago, but the memory of that day hasn't faded. It may not be Anzac Day, but it certainly felt like it. For the first time since World War II, replica Spitfires took to the sky above Petrie to mark the crash in 1944, which united a community then as now. Keith Beakey saw the crash while playing cricket at school. His memory is still vivid decades later. One lost half his wing and the other fellow lost his complete tailplane. They just spiralled down, crashed within seconds almost. The victims were British airmen based at Strathpine. Their sacrifice, a local connection to the tragedy of war. Most of the people in the area know of it and consequently come along to this day to uh, remember these servicemen that gave their lives. This is the fourth year the memorial service has been held. Organisers keen to involve the air cadets to make sure the Anzac spirit is kept alive well into the future.